My name is Baba Mal. I'm a musician and I'm from uh, Senegal. Uh, I have been doing music for more than 40 years. I did travel all over the world with my band, which is called Dan de Lenyon, the voice of the people. Now we just have launched since three years a movement uh, who is called Nanke. Nanke is based on uh, general farming, agriculture, fishing, but all the way through, techno through culture and access to technology because we think to be really competitive we should use the old opportunity that the technology offers us to be connected with the rest of the world, to be competitive and to organize ourselves in a modern way to take care about all, all the things we are going to put on to, uh, in this uh, kind of uh, movement. The fact that I put uh, this movement on is just because I have been connected to most of the people in West Africa, in African in general, and uh, by my music, and now I want to use that opportunity just to inspire. I'm not going to say that I can change the face of the world, but I want to be one inspiration to bring people to believe in themselves because they have everything, water, the land, the hand to work. They need just organization and to be connected, and I want to be one of the inspiration to make it happen. Uh, in a place where we see it's something like mm, people who have lands, for example, who want to do agriculture, we can put them together with them, some organization or ourselves, we can come and go with, with this organization to put them like a cooperative where they're going to be uh, uh, taking care about their own project. It's not Nanka coming to say to them what they do or another organization who want to say, it's them who's going to take care about their project, to, to know where they want to go, what they want to do, what kind of uh, agriculture they want to do, and we will can help them when they have crops or they have uh, anything, they, how to sell it, and to make it much easier for them, and the benefit will come back to them, and they know exactly where they want to go with it. So we're going to avoid for uh, the future. Uh, to see that people can come and grab on their lands and all of these things. It has to be, to be, if we want to inspire people, we have to bring them, bring back to them their dignity. I did notice when I travel in Africa that we have two sectors, uh, two, 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 two parts in, in the population who are really, really strong and they never get that real chance to, to be leading when it comes to economy, culture, politics, and all this question, and what this sector is, just one of them is the young people who really don't never put their hands down when it comes. They can be very, really poor but very energetic, always finding a solution. And the other stronger uh, section of the population is women, because they have the ability more than men in, in, in Africa to be to get, to come together to be focused on their project. When they get something from this project, they know how to put it on, on the table again and to make it something bigger. And, and this is a good opportunity, I was saying that. So when I did bring this uh, uh, movement uh, in the attention of people, 70% of the people just came and said, yes, this is a good opportunity for us was women. So this is why Every year we have celebrated the anniversary of the of of, of uh, the coming of this movement Nanke uh, on the uh, the date of eight of, of March. On the ground, the, the the women are doing a lot of things in Africa since they determined to change. They know they have a role to, to, to play. They are the one who take the project and go to the to, to, to the government or go to some NGO or some other association and say this is the project for for Nanka. We need to be accompanied by the, uh, your sector, and it's, it's making a difference. And I think there is a proverb in Africa who say, wherever women and children go, this is where the, the future is going.
we count a lot about on, on, on the, the people from the diaspora mm -hmm. the, because they, 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 they're not coming here for, for nothing. They're coming here to, to, to integrate, to, to cooperate with uh, people they living with here, to learn new, new things, that new, to make, a, to, make a, uh, to try to see the difference of what we have down there or we don't have, uh, or what we don't have that we can't you know, to see. Who are the partners you can work with? We count a lot about it on, 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 on the people who are from my community, from Senegal, from Africa, who live in the rest of the world, especially here in, in Barcelona and, and the region. Because we know they can bring a lot to, to these people down there. That the people, they have everything, like I say, but they need some knowledge that uh, if you don't travel, you don't get.